Hello, I'm Curtis Schwartz and welcome to my studio. Come on in. My name is Curtis Schwartz and I do music. Originally, I'm from Los Angeles. I was born in Vienna and I now live in England. A normal day in my life is usually in the recording studio, making music, either recording bands, composing music, but also being a father. Half the time I'm running my kids to and from school and being a dad. I started my career as a singer-songwriter, rock guitarist. I started this recording studio when I was 18, mainly for recording my own band, but I had a lot of friends who wanted to work with me to record their music here. So they started coming here to make their records and I found I really enjoyed making other people's records. I've worked with all kinds of musicians. I've worked with Susie and the Banshees here. They lived here for two months. A cutting crew lived here for a whole year making their record. Worked with the Bee Gees, worked with Bross. So it's a residential recording studio where you can just spend time non-stop making music. Steinway's been very important for me because I've made a lot of jazz records with fantastic jazz pianists, for example, Gwilym Simcock, where they've made it clear to me that only a Steinway D will do. I use the Steinway in many ways. I can rearrange this room so I can put it down the end. If I'm recording a big sextet, I can send it to the side. But if I'm recording a solo piano, it'll be here in the center of the room. So I move the whole room around according to the kind of lineup that I'm recording. And I record the spirio side of it always at the same time as the audio so that I can change notes after the recording. Here's his playing, so you can see his playing. We could change it, we could correct any mistakes. I know the drop-in points thanks to the Spirio recording the MIDI. When we're mixing it, when we're listening to it and thinking, oh, I wish he'd played that a little bit later, I can change his playing so we don't have to call the musician to come back. Okay, cheese toasties. This is what everyone looks forward to. At lunchtime, I make everyone cheese toasties and everyone loves them. So here I am showing you my secrets. There we go. Who wants the first one? So now we're going to pick up my two daughters, Eve and Giselle. Daddy teaches us how to play the piano. My favourite thing to do is ballet. Oh, and I want to be um, a ballerina. I've had the Spirio R for six months now and I use it every day. I use it in so many new ways. I can start ideas and then I can develop them because I can record the first pass and then I can play on top of what I've just recorded, but also use it as a sketch pad so that I can record an idea and then it's saved and then I'll never forget it. My name is Graham Griffiths. I'm an academic, a musicologist. I'm here today to record a very precious piano solo by a composer completely forgotten in history. Her name is Elisaveta Kasperova. For me, it's an absolute privilege to have brought her music back to London. I wish I knew why recording jazz with the Steinway was so perfect. The richness of the D and the bottom end is just compulsory. You have to have that resonance. The warmth of the notes, the depth, the quality, the touch, but I think you need to ask the jazz pianists about why they insist on using the Steinway D. They know. <laughs>